Hello. Uh, yes, yes sir. Yeah. We can start for hello. Hello. Yes. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you, but there is a uh, voice is getting break from your side. You can uh, enter the, what you want in the chat window. Oh, no, no. Uh, now you can hear, right? You know, from, from my side, everything is... Hi, ah, yes, yes. So now I can hear. Oh, I don't know. What now I, I can hear. <laughs> Maybe some people so. Okay, so uh, I saw that uh, I entered the query mode and I come uh, across my user ID and uh, these all are the responsibilities uh, having access to me. Okay. Yeah. And uh, based on this only, I can do uh, different works or whatever is required. So this is how this uh, user and user access is given to user access by creating username and password, then access to the different functions by providing the responsibilities. Now, what is responsibility? Responsibility is consist of the functions, menus, submenus, so which will allow you to perform some activities around a specific module. Okay, for accounts payable, there is a lot of activities are there. In that activity, what access is given to you based on your finance organization? Suppose in account, you have been given the accounts payable responsibility, but in accounts payable, you have been just asked to book the invoices for the supplier and providing mm -hmm. of uh, some different, uh, some reports in from the accounts payable module. This is the work you have been given. Likewise, mm -hmm. uh, somebody else will be given uh, payment responsibility who will do the payments to the supplier invoices. Likewise, if you define the responsibility and give access to that responsibility to a user, then only they will be able to perform the task. Suppose it is a super user or manager kind of, they can be having the super user access. So okay. if you go responsibility, let's say, I'm searching, okay. Uh, mm. If I press F4, it is mandatory field, means I have to create a, my responsibility here. If I press F11, it is query mode. I have to enter. I don't know the exact name of the responsibility, so I am searching like this. Okay. So here you see, it is the general ledger with different responsibilities are there. Okay, there are many people practicing on this server, so they have created their own uh, user IDs and uh, they have own their uh, responsibilities. So here you are providing the responsibility name, which application they are going to access, from which date they are going to access. It is available from where it is Oracle application or self-service web or mobile application like this. Then you have the data group uh, under which module it is general ledger. What is the menu? This menu will consist of submenus and function. So here you will have the, all the details. Then request group. This request group is to give you access to the reports, various reports you can run. So Likewise, you can create your own responsibilities for uh, uh, what we say uh, for your own company. Uh, but uh, as you are into end user, you will not be able to do this activity. This activity is best, uh, lies with the uh, system administrator. Okay. Okay. System administrator will create the responsibility. System administrator will create only your user ID and access 
system administrator only will assign you the uh, responsibility based on the request from manager all these activities uh, come over here so responsibility you can create and then proceed further so uh, we keep up today here only and okay. we will start with responsibility uh, means uh, tomorrow again we start with the profile option and this responsibilities again and complete the setting of organization structure and okay. we pass a test journal into it okay 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 yes so if you have any doubt you can just uh, drop me in uh, on whatsapp and also, uh, it is better to get the access to this test, test server, which I showed you just yeah. Actually, I asked, they told me they have already rented that ERP uh, worker app. So they'll give me that uh, so that I can download from my system and I can, you know, for uh, practice purpose. Rented, uh, I don't know. I told where I get that uh, practical, you know, for practice. They told, is there any, you know, software you people are going to give to, you know, students or something? Okay. So they told, they told, yeah, we are having some rented, uh, like rent type of Oracle. I don't know uh, whether it is true or not, but they told me. Okay, they'll okay. give me that so that I can, you know, from my side, I can uh, practice. Yeah, Oracle thing. Mm -hmm. Then we will give a Suresh. Uh, so a Suresh only will give. He will give. Uh, okay. So just ask him to get you the access for the server and then you can start doing the practice. Okay. And just at least okay. try to navigate and uh, you will have, uh, if he is giving you access, you will come with uh, some predefined responsibility list. You just go to the navigator and uh, just access any responsibility you like. And just... Uh, At least G GL, general, in, uh, you know, uh, GL means what? Uh, general, uh, general ledger. General ledger. Ledger and uh, that uh, general entry. That uh, if you can just uh, access the platforms, okay. But uh, until you come to know that uh, how we can enter there uh, any journal, uh, it is uh, like uh, uh, there is a risk, uh, the risk of corrupting the system. Oh, uh, because if some okay. uh, something we have done and that is uh, not allowing us to work further and process something else then it is a risk there that system is getting corrupted. So okay. access the forms, not an issue. You can go anywhere. It's just like, uh, see, I am over here. Okay. I explained to you how to query F11, control F11. You can come on the system yeah. administrator, go to the user, go to the responsibilities and like accounts table is there. You just uh, uh, responsibilities under responsibility define. This page will open. Press F11 and search for accounts table like this and press control F11. You will get accounts table responsibilities. Likewise, you can just navigate and query and get it. And uh, on this file is there. Edit is there, view is there. You can just uh, navigate on this screen, but uh, I prefer you should not do any entry or something uh, till tomorrow because from tomorrow. Yeah, then better, better I'll ask up tomorrow, tomorrow or else Monday I'll ask for. Okay, It'll but be... you get the system access by tomorrow. Because by tomorrow, okay. If you not do the practice, it will be. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, I understand. If I will not do, then it it will, you know, I I will not uh, theoretical and practical. Yes, it's yes, exactly. yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. and every session uh, will be uh, recording will be shared, so yeah, no worry. You can. Uh, can you please share me that Excel set as well, so it will be good for me to understand. Okay, okay, uh, I will share that Excel as well. 
Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Thank you.